What's up everyone? This is Max Simplifier. Today I've got some amazing, amazing, amazing news. Now, if you have been watching my recent videos, you may have watched a video about how can you change your dashboard background image, your mission control background image, your launchpad uh, folder background of the launchpad background image, and many other things. And we had to go to the finder, we had to go to the system files and edit them and then take a backup and all of those things. However, those things are tiring. So that's why there has been a recent solution, which is an application called as Lion Designer. And of course, you're going to find the download link in the description below. Let me show you a preview about Lion Designer. Lion Designer version 2, okay, is first of all something totally free. It doesn't mean that I had I haven't cracked it or anything. It's already free, so you can update it whenever you want. Now, as you can read from over here, you can change the mission control background image, the dashboard background image, the launchpad folder icon also, the launchpad folder background image, and even the login screen background image. It's really an amazing application, seriously, an amazing application. And if, if you really feel like you want your system um, the default image is back, you simply press on, press on reset and everything's fine. It's really an amazing application. I enjoyed it so much. So all, all that you have to do is simply press on change, select the image that you want, and even when you download this application, you're going to get some images for you. And once you've done that, you press on apply, you enter your password, uh, and like this, the image will be successfully uh, changed. So it's a really, really amazing feature. Okay, so, but before ending this video, I would like to say something first. For those of you who had changed the dashboard background image or the launchpad folder background image or the mission control background image by editing the system files, then the default, the default images for line designer over here will be the images that you have actually changed. You got my point? So if you want a uh, line designer to like um, to have the default images as the system default images, you have to change back the images to what they were before. So you have to have your backup of the previous or the genuine background images of each of the mission mission control, the dashboard, and uh, the launch pad folder background image. And if you don't have it, you're going to find this file and this file as a download link in the description below. All that you've got to do is copy both of those files and then press on shift command G. Go to slash system slash library slash core services slash doc dot app slash content slash. Once you go over there, you go for resources and you paste both of those files over here. This is going to get and then you go for the terminal. You open it up and then you type in kill all doc then you press on enter once you do so uh, you're going to get um, the, the original background image for the dashboard and the mission control and uh, for the launchpad folder background image to get the default one back you're going to use line tweaks and you're going to also find the uh, download link in the description below um, it will be actually another video okay so what's the point of doing this is that when you open line designer and you press on reset it gets you to the original uh, images that were there in the first place because if you have before using this application if you have changed the images for example by editing the system files then line designer will, will read the default images as the images that you have installed already so just to make things a little bit less complicated, this is what you're supposed to do. Simply get the images back to their normal state by going to this location and pasting those two image files that you're going to find in the description below and getting the launchpad folder background image to its default uh, by watching a video that will also be in the description below. And then you're free to use Line Designer by changing the image whenever you want it and applying it or if you want to get it back to the way it was by simply resetting it. Well, that's it for this video. Thank you very much for watching. Please do subscribe, and if you have any comments, leave it below.